Hi everyone. In this video, I'm going to do a quick walkthrough of application summary dashboard in Splunk Run. Let's assume I'm a SRE engineer and I begin my day by looking across all of the applications that I monitor and see which one needs my most attention. Up till now, I just didn't have a good way to do this in RUM, but with application summary dashboard, I can look at multiple apps which I'm monitoring and see which one needs most critical attention. So for example, I'm looking at two days, day, two days worth of data across all of my environments and all of my apps. I can see the web app and mobile app, and right away I get all of the important metrics for both of these apps. I can expand on these to see uh, in depth how these apps are performing. But at this point, let's say I want to see which, which of these apps requires my immediate attention today and how I can route it to the right team. So right away, I can see that there's a higher error rate in the hipster demo web app. So maybe this is something that I could start with over here. I can now expand this view and right away I see that this particular error which is cannot read properties of undefined is happening at a rate of 688 per minute. I can click over here and then look at how the error has been trending. It's stack trace and go to tag spotlight or look at relevant user sessions. So right away from the overview page, I'm able to kind of go to the particular error and within few minutes of time, I'm able to route this error to our front end team so that they can look at this issue and fix it. Now let's, let's talk a little bit more about this page, what all it shows. So as you can see, it's actually a more visual representation of the top RUM metrics that any particular engineer may care about. You can see your total page views in respect to total errors that are occurring. You can look at all of your network requests, which are basically an addition of your backend request and any sort of resource request in respect to the errors which are happening. We already walked through top JavaScript errors, which are grouped over here by stack trace. And towards the right over here, you can actually see web vitals, which are basically search engine optimization metrics used by Google. And over here, we have actually color coded them so that it's easier for you to see whether you're in the right range of these metrics or not. And then you can click on each of these tiles to actually go to tag spotlight and look at these metrics more closely. In addition to that, this particular tile over here actually shows you most recent detectors or alerts that have been triggered on your app. So for example, over here, this particular alert was triggered in past few days with a count of 55. So I can actually click on this and go to IMM to actually look at the list of alerts that were triggered and see what exactly happened. That kind of concludes my walkthrough of application summary dashboard and how an SRE engineer or a front-end engineer may use this dashboard um, to identify the app that they would like to drill down into and then proceed to uh, investigate in a Splunk Rum overview page or tag spotlight view. Thanks.